everybody, and welcome back to Undertale. I found Tenny Village. Oh, I missed this last time. Hi, welcome to Tim Village. Hi, hoi, I'm Teddy, and this is my friend Teddy. Hi, I'm Teddy, and this is my friend Teddy. Hi, I'm Teddy. Don't forget my friend. God damn these things. Hi, I'm Blah. Oh wait, hang on. Hi, I'm Bob. Bob. <laughs> 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 Humans, sushi, cat! Tim, watch egg! Egg, we'll hatch! Tim, proud parent! It's our wild! Statue of Tim, very famous. Mary! Feeling of being watched! Uh, yeah, there's a, there's a Timmy there. A Tim there. Mushroom dance. Mushroom dance. Whatever could it mean? <laughs> I'm pretty sure I did that pretty well. It symbolizes my inner torment, trapped here by my hyphen, hyphae. My struggle to pull away, my struggle to escape, but alas, to no avail. <laughs> Tim her human allergies to Tim. Is that okay? Tim understand? Tim also allergic to Tim. <laughs> <laughs> Hives! <laughs> You're allergic to yourself! <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> Hi! You should check out Temp Shop! Yeah, <laughs> I agree! Should check Temp Shop! <laughs> Hi! Welcome to the Temp Shop! <laughs> Say hello! Hi! I'm Temmy! Hi! I'm Tammy! <laughs> Tem history! Us Tems have a deep history! <laughs> Watch shop! Yeah, yeah! Go to Tem shop! <laughs> what the hell are you? <laughs> You're Tammy. Tem flight kills 2 HP! Food of Tem! Discount food of Tem! <laughs> Tem flake on <laughs> Tem flake expensive! <laughs> Tem food of Tem. Pay. Tem pay for college! Tem pursue higher education. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Best song yet! You feel. Some. Should I save up a thousand gold so Tem can go to college? <laughs> I don't know. I <laughs> really clipped the microphone like a motherfucker there. <laughs> I'm sorry, I had to do, I had to do it. Alright, we're gonna head back to Hotland now. Um, wrong way. I'm gonna get around here. Ah, uh, Tem. If I could save up a thousand gold, I'll come back and I'll I'll give you a thousand gold so you can go to college. Although I personally would never go to college, I don't see the point. That's just me, though. anywhere I haven't been before? Oh wait, yeah, no, this is the wish thing. It's the bridge! Screw that guy! Music cuts out because this is where once your face chases you. Can I hop on one of these? No, they pass under. Okay. I still can't believe the friggin... Actually, wait a minute. Let's call Papyrus. Ring, ring. Hey! Isn't this where I called you? I have a photographic memory for phone calls. Uh, hey, when are we gonna hang, uh, hang with Undyne? Where is Undyne? Wait, 
I think I know where to dine is. I'm gonna go. Will Toriel fucking pick up? God damn it, Toriel! Just because I left you doesn't mean you have to be such a bitch. I wonder why Toriel... No, I guess it's because Toriel doesn't want the humans to pay for, like... It's like, eh... Modern day, like nowadays, you know, if this is modern, since they have TVs and all that stuff, I'm pretty sure there'd be a lot of people who wouldn't really try to kill them. Yeah, but, you know, it's weird because Asgore, you know, even if Asgore got the seven hearts and destroyed the barrier, it's like the rest of the monsters are still weak. Not to mention the fact that he's just one guy with seven human souls, so... You know, it'd probably end up being kind of an anime type thing where, ah, uh, seven people gather together and kick his ass and all that stuff and save the world anyway, so whatever. I think Undyne's house is back this way. If it's not, then I'll just skip ahead to the hot land. Human arrives! Are you ready to hang out with Undai? I have a plan to make you two great friends! Sure, let's fucking hang out. Okay, stand behind me! Psst! Make sure to give her this! She loves these! <laughs> Hi, Papyrus! Ready for your extra private one on one training? You bet I am! Wait a minute, did she like him? And I brought a friend! Uh, uh, hi, I don't think we've... <coughs> why, why don't you two come in? <laughs> Here and dine! My friend brought a gift for you on their own! I'll, uh, I'll put it with the others. <laughs> so, uh, are we ready to start? Uh, whoopsie doopsie. I just remembered I have to go to the bathroom. You two have fun. Whee! <laughs> right out the fucking window. So why are you here? To rub your victory in my face? To humiliate me even further? Is that it? Then why are you here? Wait, I get it. You think that I'm gonna be friends with you, huh? Right? Yes! Really? How delightful! I accept! Let's all frolic in the fields of friendship! Not! Why would I ever be friends with you? If you weren't my house guest, I'd beat you up right now. You're the enemy of everyone's hopes and dreams. I will never be your friend. Now get out of my house. Dang, what a shame. I thought Undyne could be friends with you, but I guess I overestimated her. She's just not up to the challenge. Challenge? <laughs> Thank you, Papyrus. Uh, what? Papyrus, wait a second! Darn it. He thinks I can't be friends with you? <laughs> what a joke! I could make friends with a would-be loser like you any day. I'll show him. Listen up, human. We're not just going to be friends. We're going to be... BESTIES! <laughs> I'll make you like me so much you won't be able to think of anyone else. <laughs> it's the perfect revenge. Why don't you have a seat? <laughs> yes! <laughs> Sit down and progress. This is awesome. Comfortable? I'll get you something to drink. <laughs> uh, 
I'll say. What would you like? <laughs> hey! Don't get up! You're the guest! Sit down and enjoy yourself! <laughs> um, uh, why not just point to what you want? You can use the spear! Aim with arrows and select the steam. Sugar goes in tea. Soda. Sickly yellow liquid. Hot chocolate. Green cylinder. Tea box. Blatantly correct choice. <laughs> tea, huh? I'm coming right up. Blatantly correct choice. <laughs> yeah. Suck on it, Undine. It'll take a moment for the water to boil. So, uh, <laughs> okay, it's all done. <laughs> Suck on it. <laughs> Your table's broken, by the way. Here we are. Careful, it's hot. It's not that hot. Just drink it already. You take a sip of the tea. It's burning. But other than that, it's pretty good. It's pretty good, right? Nothing but the best for my absolutely precious friend. Uh, hey, you know, it's kind of strange you chose that tea. Golden flower tea. That's Asgore's favorite kind. Actually, now that I think about it, you kind of remind me of him. You're both total weenies. <laughs> uh, sort of. You know, I was a pretty hot-headed kid. Once, to prove I was the strongest, I tried to fight Asgore. Emphasis on tried. I couldn't land a single blow on him. And worse, the whole time he refused to fight back. I was so humiliated. Afterwards, he apologized and said something goofy. Excuse me, do you want to know how to beat me? I said yes, and from then on, he trained me. But one day, during practice, I finally knocked him down. I felt bad, uh, but he was beaming. I had never been so seen someone more proud to get their butt kicked. Anyway, long story short, he kept training me. And now I'm the head of the Royal Guard. So I'm the one who gets to train dorks to fight! <laughs> uh, like, uh, Papyrus. <laughs> but, um, to be honest, I don't know if I can ever let Papyrus into the Royal Guard. Uh, don't tell him I said that. He's just... well... I mean, it's not that he's weak. He's actually pretty freaking tough. It's just that he's... he's too innocent and nice. I mean, look, he was supposed to capture you, and he ended up bringing friends with you instead. I could never send him into battle. He'd get ripped into little smiling shreds. Now that's part of why I started teaching him how to cook, y you know? So, um, maybe he can do something else with his life. <clears throat> oh, uh, sorry I was talking for so long. You're out of tea, aren't you? I'll get you some more. Wait a second. Papyrus. His cooking lesson. He was supposed to have that right now! And he's not here to have it! You'll have to have it for him! <laughs> this is gonna be intense, isn't it? That's right! Nothing has brought Papyrus and I closer than cooking! Which means that if I give you his lesson, we'll become closer than you can even ever imagine! <laughs> Afraid? We're gonna be best friends! It grabs me by the head, just jumps up. Let's start with the sauce. <laughs> Is that a banana? Envision these vegetables as your greatest enemy. Now, pound them to dust with your fists. How will you pound them? Pound strong. You punch the vegetables at full force. You knock over a tomato. Yeah, yeah. Our hearts are uniting against these healthy ingredients. Now it's my turn. Yeah! BAM! <laughs> God damn it. Uh, I'll just scrape this into a bowl later. It's all over your face. But for now, <laughs> we have the new 
tacos. Homemade noodles are the best. But I just buy snow bread. They're the cheapest. Yeah! Uh, just put them in the pot. How will you put them in? This time she said, just put them in. You place the noodles in one at a time. They clink against the empty bottle. Nice. All right. Now it's time to stir the pasta. As a general rule of thumb, the more you stir, the better it is. Ready? Let's do it. Stir harder. 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 Cut. Let me do it. <laughs> That's the step. All right. Now for the final step. Turn up the heat. Let the stove stop. Stove stop. Symbolize your passion. Let your hopes and dreams turn into burning fire. Ready? Don't hold anything back. Hold right to turn up the heat. <laughs> Hotter. <laughs> Hotter. Darn it. Hotter. <laughs> God damn it, I'm dying. Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, man, no wonder Papyrus sucks at cooking. Uh, your house is on fire. Uh, so what's next? Uh, scrapbooking? Uh, friendship bracelets? Oh, uh, who am I kidding? I really screwed this up, didn't I? I can't force you to like me, human. Some people just don't get along with each other. I understand if you feel that way about me. And if we can't be friends, that's okay. Because if we are not friends, it means I can destroy you without regret! <laughs> I've been defeated. My house is in shambles. I even failed to befriend you. That's it. I don't care if you're my guest anymore. One final rematch. All out on both sides. It's the only way I can regain my lost pride. Now come on, hit me with all you've got. Yeah! Is letting you make the first attack. Show me what you've got. Fake attack. You pretend to swing it and die with all your might. One. <laughs> you can manage? You were attacking at full force? You just can't muster any intent, intent to hurt me, huh? <laughs> you know what? I don't actually want to hurt you either. At first I hated your stupid saccharine shtick, but the way you hit me right now, it reminded me of someone I used to train with. Now I know you aren't some just some wimpy loser. You're a wimpy loser with a big heart. Just like him. Listen, human. It seems that you and Asgore are fated to fight, but knowing him, he probably doesn't want to. Talk to him. I'm sure you can persuade him to let you go home. Eventually, some mean human will fall down here, and I'll take their soul instead. That makes sense, right? <laughs> oh, and if you do hurt Asgore, I'll take the human souls, cross the barrier, and beat the hell out of you. That's what friends are for, right? <laughs> now let's get the hell out of this flaming house. <laughs> ah, her house is crying. Well, that was fun, huh? We'll have to hang out again another time. But, uh, somewhere else, I guess. In the meantime, I guess I'll go hang out with Papyrus. So if you need me, drop by Snowden, okay? Oh, if you ever need help, just give Papyrus a ring, okay? Since we're in the same spot, I'll be able to talk too. Well, see you later, punk. Sounds like only fire lives here now. <laughs> Papyrus and Undine. Ring, ring. And that's Undine's house. It's a great place to... Uh... <sighs> yeah, that's my house. Uh, hi, Undine. Uh, how'd you get here so fast? I ran. Uh, I ran. Wowee, Undine. Someday I want to be as strong and sweaty as you. <laughs> what the fuck? God, I love this game. <laughs> oh, jeez. <sighs> okay. Uh, you know what? I kind of want to go back and see what they're doing. <laughs> but 
Whoo, that cooking, man! I, I, uh... Can I pick the anime up? It's a DVD case for an anime. Desperate claw marks cover the edges. Unless it's already gone, it's just a case. Jeez, dude. <laughs> Uh, what the hell are you? Oh, you're a... I clean all of the trash and arrange it into symmetrical piles. It's hard work, but somebody has to do it. Wait. I fell down here, so how do I get back to Snowden? Maybe later. I guess. Alright, well, then, let's just, uh... Head back to Heatland. Or Hotland. Hotland, not Heatland. Okay, so we're finally back at Hotland. I figured I'd skip that just so you don't have to walk, walk back. Okay, 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 okay. I was thirsty, so I came over from Waterfall to get a drink. Could you have just gotten a drink there? Okay, well then. Let's see, what does Papyrus have to say about this? Ring, ring. <laughs> what? What? Royal guards are blocking the way! Then I'll tell them to... Well, nothing, I guess. I already told them to seek out and destroy you. And I can't just tell them I've changed my mind. Uh, you see, Alpha showed me the, uh, these animations about, uh, humans? So I could learn their weaknesses? And one of them is about this human that, uh... Well, suffice to say, they can control people's minds. Surprised? I know your kind's hidden power. Anyway, I told my crew that if I ever defended a, defended a human, I must be under some kind of mind control and to disregard everything that I tell them. So, sorry, but my hands are tied. By the way, that animation is really good. Yep, she watches the anime. <laughs> of course. Who are you? Tra -la -la. I'm the river man. Or am I the river woman? It doesn't really matter. I love to ride in my boat. Would you care to join me? Sure. Where will we go today? Oh, we can go to Snowden. Let's go back to Snowden. Then we're off. I want to see what Papyrus and Sans and Undine are, Un Undine are up to. Ah. Uh, well, there was it. There was a comma there. Why was there a comma? Oh, I found my way back to Snowden. Thanks. Come again sometime. Tra la la. Oh wait, is it they're back over this way? Oh no, they're down here. Uh, was it? No, it was this way? Yep, there we go. <laughs> I'm so glad you and Undyne are friends now. You two go together like pasta and burning. Those two things don't go together, prepares. <laughs> uh, hey, punk. What's up? That's you! Papyrus, how can you stand this cold? I have no skin. So why don't we stand in grillbees instead? Because I hate grease. But you, but you don't have a stomach. No, but I have standards. <laughs> God damn it. This rock is covered in spring. Okay, uh, let's see. Can I talk to Sans? I want to talk to Sans. I want to see if I can talk to Sans. The door is locked. Nope, can't talk to Sans. <laughs> <Damn it. laughs> uh, wait a minute. If he doesn't have a stomach, why does he eat spaghetti? And how does Sans eat condiments? Ugh. How do either of them eat? Yes. Riding boat? Yes. Where would we go today? Hotland. The fucking dog, man. Fuck that dog. God damn. Tra la la. Temi Village. The room before the darkening lantern room. <laughs> I looked at my inventory earlier and I had like magical dog poop or something. It was weird. It wasn't called that, but it was still fucking weird, and I'm pretty sure that's what it's hinting at. <laughs> Alright, let's, uh... Sorry. Undyne, like, told us it was totally a human in the area, so, like... Us royal guards are blocking off the elevators for now. Go. Even if 
the elevators aren't working anyway. We'll do our best, Ms. Noondine. What do you have to say? Dot, dot, dot. Okay, let's go to the lab then. Okay. It's too dark to see near the walls. Okay. Who do we have here? Whoa, who are you? I didn't expect you to show up so soon. Yeah, I haven't showered. I'm barely dressed. It's all messy and... Um, uh, hiya. I'm Doc... Oh, wait, you're a, you're a girl, too. Oh, God, there's so many girls. Uh... Until I come up with something. I'm Dr. Alphys. I'm Asgore's royal scientist, but, but, but uh, I'm not one of the bad guys. Actually, since you stepped out of the ruins, I've um, been observing your journey through my console. Uh, your fights, your friendships, everything. I was originally going to stop you, but watching someone on a screen really makes you root for him. So, so uh, now I want to help you. Using my knowledge, I can easily guide you through Hotland. I know I way right to Asgore's castle. No problem. Well, actually, um, there's just a tiny issue. A long time ago, I made a robot named Metaton. Originally, I built him to be an entertainment robot. Uh, you know, like a robotic TV star or something. Anyway, I recently decided to make him more useful. Uh, you know, just some small practical adjustments. Like, um, anti... Anti-human combat features? Uh, of course, when I saw you coming, I immediately decided I have to remove those features. Unfortunately, I may have made a teensy mistake while doing so, and um, now he's an unstoppable killing machine with a thirst for human blood. <laughs> but um, hopefully we won't run into him. He's gonna come right from behind you and. Uh, you hear something? Oh no. Oh yes! Welcome, beauties! To today's good show! Oh boy, I can already tell it's gonna be a great show! Everyone give a big hand for our wonderful contestant! Never played before, gorgeous? No problem, it's simple. There's only one rule. Answer correctly. Or you die. That's, that's Metaton. Not exactly threatening. Let's start with an easy one. What's the price for answering correctly? A... Ha <laughs> ha You wish wrong! The quiz show continues. Wait a minute, what? Here's your terrific prize! What's the king's full name? Asgore Demur! Correct! What a terrific answer! The quiz show continues. Enough about you, let's talk about me! What are robots made out of? Metal and magic? Too easy for you, huh? Here's another easy one for you. Two trains training. Oh, uh, wonderful. I'm astounded, folks. Thanks, Alphys. Quiz show continues. Don't count on your victory. How many flies are in this jar? Correct. You're so lucky today. <laughs> Let's play memory game. What monster is this? Oh, that's, um, Rocket. Oh, bullshit! That was bullshit! All right, I'll just listen to her. But can you get this one? Would you smooch a ghost? Great answer, I love it. 
Shell continues. If only Blue Key was here. Here's a simple one. How many letters in the name Metroton? Of course that was easy for you. <laughs> Time to break out the big guns. The dating simulation video game Mew Mew Kissy Cutie. Oh, I know this one. It's snail ice cream in the first chapter. Everyone goes to the beach. She buys ice cream for all her friends. But it snails. Snail. <laughs> it's actually a very popular message about friendship and... Alphas, Alphas, Alphas. You aren't helping our contestant, are you? Ooh, you should have told me. I'll ask a question you'll be sure to know the answer to. Who does Dr. Alphas have a crush on? Is it Asgore or is it Undi? Undi? <laughs> is it me? I don't know! <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Correct. Dr. Elvis has a crush on the unknowable. You see, Dr. Elvis believes there is someone out there. Someone watching her. Someone she thinks is cute. Interesting. Hello, theoretical person. Dr. Elvis likes you. Too bad you are not real. Duris. <laughs> Duris of Laugh Crack. <laughs> hey, I've done research about this. There are alternate universes out there. Someday, maybe I could meet them. <laughs> You said the exact thing about me and me and Kissy Cute. But I'm giving you the benefit of the doubt. I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. Person, if you're out there, how about giving us a sign right now? That's me. <laughs> that settles that, doesn't it? <laughs> well, well, with Dr. Elphus helping you, the show has no dramatic tension. We can't go on like this. But, but, this is just the pilot episode. Next up, more drama, more romance. More bloodshed. Until next time, darlings. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> well, that certainly was some was certainly something. It's a bag of dog food. It's half. Wait, wait. Uh, let me give you my phone number. And then maybe if you need help, I could. What? Where'd you get that phone? It's ancient. It doesn't even have texting. Wait a second. Please. <laughs> what the hell? Here. I upgraded it for you. It can do texting. Items. It's got a keychain. I even signed you up for the Underground's number one social network. And now we're officially friends. <laughs> Going to the bathroom. Well, it's me that you like, isn't it? Fridge is filled with instant noodles and soda. Take a package of noodles? Yes. It's beat up figurine of a female human with cat ears. It's teacup shaped like a little yellow lizard. It's full of soda. Eh, ah, Pikachu, huh? It's a computer. It acts as some kind of puzzle in Snowden. Seems like the notes to something, but it's all written in chicken scratch. It seems like a walkthrough to a game, or a garbage can, but it's pretty cute. It's a video feed of your location. Okay, that's down. Yellow feet are tapping just behind the door. It's bathroom time. What are we doing? No, go back. The space between the wall is only a few feet wide. What's up here? Scientific books. They seem very dusty. All these books are labeled human history. Read them. You look inside a book. It's a comic of a giant robot fighting a beautiful alien princess. This doesn't strike you as very accurate. <laughs> VHSs and DVDs of various cartoons. They are all labeled human history. All these books are labeled human history. Read one. You look inside a book. It's a comic book. Two scantily clad chefs are flinging energy pancakes at each other. This doesn't strike you as. Uh, is this what? It, is the? Is this what people would think of us if they saw it? And like, what the hell? Ugh. A hideous android is run, ru running to school with toast in its mouth. It seems like it's late. 
What the hell is this? Pink goop drips from this strange machine. <laughs> Looks like Alphys' work table. Seems dusty. Nice, uh, nice poster there. The wardrobe is full of dirty lab coats and a single clean dress. There are letters from many monsters here. Froggit, Snowy, Doggo. They're all unopened. It's a lamp with pink fish on the lamp sheet. There's no light bulb. An incredible invention. When not in use, this bed folds into an extremely easy to draw box. It's a promo poster from Mehatons TV premiere. On the flap it says, thank you for making my dreams come true. Yeah, Alphys, you're kind of weird. <laughs> oh god, it's like that one anime. Oh, what is it called? I don't remember. There's this like, one anime. Alphys is updated status. Just realized I don't watch Undyne fight the... I didn't watch Undyne fight the human. Dimensional box A? Oh, I can access my box! Oh, written in... No, of course Toriel's not gonna fucking answer. Uh, spider cider and the butterscotch pie. Yeah, dog residue. Oh, okay. I can put some stuff in there. Let's see what they have to say. Neither of us know anything about Hotland, uh, so we'll just have to have to combine our power. Zero plus zero is still a zero. Yeah, but it's a big zero. Yeah! <laughs> well, I know she's unbeatable. I'll ask her about it later. Let's see what happens. Oh, wait, I can't call. I can't call her. <laughs> Let's see, what do you do? Heals blank HP. Comes with everything you need for a quick meal. For now, I gotta call up the human and guide them. Uh. Oh, right. No, you didn't. Vulcan. Let's hug the volcano. You give Vulcan a hug. It warms your heart. And your whole body. Ouch! Your defense dropped. Uh, so lovely. Whoa! Whoa! Spare. Alright, let's, uh... Let's use it. Okay. I'm gonna call them in a minute. Like a body. Still waiting on that phone call, Alphys, although I'm pretty sure I made it the whooshing sound of steam and cause. It fills you with determination. Okay. Alright, we'll go I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. <laughs> I love the characters in this game. They're so eccentric and awesome. Ha! Ah. Anyway, hopefully you enjoyed this episode. If you did, go ahead and leave a like or share it with a friend. Or you can leave a comment down below if anything else you'd like to see me play, do, or draw. Anyway, thanks again for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Later!